How would you feel about traveling farther than any human has ever gone before? I mean, isn't that why we signed up? I'm, I'm stoked about it. I grew up in Baldwin, New York. So between my junior and senior years of high school, I went to officer candidate school for 10 weeks. And then after graduating from college, I commissioned as a second lieutenant in the United States Marine Corps. Since I was a kid, I had wanted to be an astronaut. In sixth grade, I did a book report on Valentina Tereshkova, uh, first female in space, and we had to dress up uh, like the person we did the book report on. And, you know, so my mom helped me make a little a space suit. So it just kind of has always been in the background something I've wanted to do that's uh, somewhat driven my path in life. I had just taken a red-eye flight out to North Carolina for my good friend's wedding and you know I hadn't gotten any sleep on the flight got to the hotel room luckily they were kind enough to let me check in early and I was standing outside the hotel room door I had my suitcase my backpack my uniform bag and my sword because I was going to be in the sword art so my hands were full trying to get the door open my phone's in my back pocket and suddenly it starts ringing finally I get the door open I drop everything, shut the door. I think I even left my suitcase out in the hallway and uh, and it was the act uh, a couple members of the astronaut selection board. And so, you know, I answered the phone as calmly as I possibly could in that moment. In social sciences, I've always, you know, loved history and English and all those other classes as well, but I always just gravitated towards the sciences and math and you know physics was always one of my favorite subjects and for me both my parents studied architecture so the design aspect I also was very into which is I think what drew me towards engineering and then you combine that with my interest in the space program from a young age and aerospace engineering just seemed pretty natural. Surround yourself with good people that have the characteristics that you want to uh, to grow in yourself. I think if you surround yourself with people like that, you kind of bring each other up to a higher and higher level as you go. And I, I don't think there's, a, there's anything that can help more than that. Subscribe for more space. space, space.